Với mục tiêu hướng đến sự phát triển bền vững, Liên Hợp Quốc đã kêu gọi sự cải tiến dữ liệu. Việt Nam cùng UNU Wider, Viện Nghiên cứu Kinh tế Phát triển Thế giới thuộc Đại học Liên Hiệp Quốc và các thành viên đã thiết lập biểu đồ dữ liệu về sự phát triển nhanh chóng của các quốc gia. Lật bài video tại đây sẽ chia sẻ một số bài học đã được rút ra. Before 2015, Vietnam and Korea have no trade agreement yet, so they asked us to do an analysis to see what is the impact. The first and the main set of data I use is social accounting matrix. Social accounting matrix is a data set which uh, describes the whole economy and the whole interaction between the different entities in the economy. You can imagine that you will have a square matrix, so each row and each column will present for one entity in the economy. For example, one type of industrial uh, producer. It is actually is a number, but with all the flow of the incomes and on flows of expenditure, of flow of the money in the economy. With that data set, uh, we can use it to see the impacts of the policy on the household, what's the impacts on the producer, and even the impacts on the government revenue. So the government will use it as the input information to decide what type of tariffs should we ask Korea to reduce for Vietnam. We don't know that this data set exists until the U and U wider partner come to Vietnam and uh, together with us to build and uh, develop this uh, social accounting matrix. With the result of the uh, study using the social accounting matrix, Vietnamese governments have signed the trade agreement with Korea with the expectation that we will get more benefits from uh, this trade agreement in terms of economic growth, in terms of the employment and in terms of other the social welfare improvement.